Well, Corey is checking out the Awatsuki Foothills Nutcracker Ballet. This is one of my favorite live shots you do every year, Corey, because uh, I just love watching these dancers dance. They're love so it. talented. I know. Isn't it great? And uh, yeah, w w we might as well get them before they get into motion because it's so hard to uh, uh, catch them. Oh, there we go. I guess the music's already started. Well, that's okay. Keep it, keep it going. That's fine. I, I, I'm with you, Troy and Celeste. This is just one of the best times of the year. We love seeing all these kids in action. And Kimberly Lewis is with us. She knows everything about the production. And I think this is year 20, 20th right? 20th anniversary. Can you Congratulations. believe it? Congratulations. We're so excited. Well, you really do put on one of the loveliest productions in the whole valley. And I think something that's pretty unique is they're all kids, they're no all no adults. No, they're all children ages 2 to 18 years of age. So it's the only Nutcracker done in the entire country by children. Well, that's that's a great credit to, to you and to the whole uh, program because you're grooming these little ones from a very young age to be able to perform some pretty sophisticated roles. Yes, exactly. Yes, they usually have to wait until they're in their 20s to dance the role of the Sugar Plum Fairy and the Snow mm -hmm. Queen and all these major roles. So this gives um, the young children opportunities to dance these roles at a very young age. Well, you've got a couple of great, perf well, several performances coming up uh, this weekend, yes. right? Uh, give us the nuts and bolts, the we times have, and days. We have three shows this weekend. We have Saturday the 14th at 12 noon and 5.30 and Sunday the 15th at 1 p.m. And following both daytime shows on Saturday and Sunday, afterwards we turn on the snow, it's falling snow inside the theater, and Santa Claus comes out on stage, and all the, the Sugar Plum Fairy and Clara and the Nutcracker Mouse King all come out to meet the audience and sign autographs How and take pictures. Fun. Uh, now, um, where are you going to be performing, by the way, so everybody knows? The actual performance is held at the Desert Vista Fine Arts Theater. Okay, and where's that located? It's located in the Ahwatukee Foothills community. Look at these cuties, golly. And your costumes, by the way, my compliments. They're really fantastic. Thank you. They're all hand <laughs> handmade and designed. And we start in August um, preparing not only for the Nutcracker with all of our rehearsals, but also with all the costumes as well. Very good. Well, it's going to be a great weekend, everybody. It's the Desert Foothills uh, Company's production of the Nutcracker and if you've never seen the Nutcracker come on get on board uh, it is just one of the most timeless and beautiful oh this is my favorite part sword play this is why the boys should come to see the show because there will be stabbing and running and jumping <laughs> Don't, not me not yeah, me Corey. with the sword yeah that was close very close oh let me see your sword there buddy show that sword off Give one of your moves right into the camera. Oh, that's what we're talking oh, about. Oh, yeah. See you again I'm in a few minutes. With, that <laughs> with, a yeah. with a smile. <laughs> what a cutie he is. That's right. Corey's live at the Awachuki Foothills Nutcracker Ballet this morning. With Very these cool. Kiddos. Yeah, so we'll see him in just a little bit. <laughs> Don't poke him in the eye. Be careful. Some proud parents down in Awachuki. Yeah, there are. I know that because of these dancing kids. Hey, bud. Yeah. Well, one thing we know about the Nutcracker is it's very sophisticated. Am I right? <laughs> yeah, that's right. Yeah, everybody looks great. Their costumes look great, but again, they're still just kids. It's an all kid production of the Nutcracker. And they're showing us their best faces. Wait till you see how prim and proper they are in a couple of minutes. More coming your way in just a couple. <laughs> Some proud parents down in Ahwatukee. Yeah, there are. I know that because of these dancing kids. Hey, bud. Yeah. Well, one thing we know about the Nutcracker is it's very sophisticated. Am I right? <laughs> yeah, that's right. Yeah, everybody looks great. Their costumes look great, but again, they're still just kids. It's an all-kid production of the Nutcracker, 
and they're showing us their best faces. Wait till you see how prim and proper they are in a couple of minutes. More coming your way in just a couple. <laughs>Corey is checking out the Awatuki Foothills Nutcracker Ballet. Yeah, hey, Cor. Hey, is that Bella behind you? I think I know the, the one in the purple. Is that Bella? It is Bella. Hey, oh. Bella. Oh. Hi. I do, Ashley. Yeah, Ashley. <laughs> Joy's saying hello right now, actually. Um, wow. Hold on just one second. We'll chat a little bit, then we'll get your music going. Uh, Bella, this is Zora. She plays Clara. Of course, you are the Sugar Plum yes. Fairy. Clara... You have a terrible brother in this show, right? Yes. What is his main problem? I'm sick of him busting up your stuff. I don't know. He's just a little brother. Yeah, that's, th little that's his role, yeah. right? I get you. And uh, Avery, you play the Snow Queen. Yes, I do. Look at all your princesses behind you. I know. That's pretty nice to travel with a posse like that. I know. They follow me around everywhere. It's a nice way to live, <laughs> yes, isn't it? it? Is. All right. Well, take your places, ladies. And uh, we're going to get uh, right over this way. And let's talk about... Oh, this is such a beautiful dance. Oh. This is one of the favorites, is it not? I love the snow scene. And we actually do have snow that falls inside the theater while they're dancing. Well, everyone should know that one thing you've really tried to do is make this as accessible as possible, even for the littlest audience members, right? Exactly. Because this is like a children's nutcracker, this is the perfect nutcracker to bring children as young as... Children as young as one years of age can sit through and enjoy this beautiful nutcracker. We actually have the angels dancing on the fog. 
We have snow coming through the theater and a Christmas tree that grows through the ceiling. So this, so much excitement going on that it keeps the attention of little ones as well. I always love that. Yes, when there's so much action on the stage, they're they're really transfixed. I love to see little ones watching the Nutcracker. Well, let's one more time get the uh, nuts and bolts in where the production is, the times, and so forth. Yes, the production is going to be held this Saturday the 14th at 12 noon and 5.30 p.m. and Sunday the 15th at 1 p.m. Tickets are available online at afnutcracker.com, that's our website, or afnutcracker.com forward slash tickets. So you can purchase your tickets online, or you can actually call Dance Studio 111 at 480-706-6040 and purchase them over the phone through us. Good. We'll get all of that up on our website as well. And just so everybody knows, your dancers come from all over the valley, right? And when do they audition? Correct. This audition for this Nutcracker is open to dancers from all over the valley. And we start the second weekend in August. And these dancers have been in rehearsal every Saturday and Tuesday and Thursday nights since August. So they really need every uh, their support of everybody um, around the Valley to come and watch their performances because there's nothing better and more rewarding to have that curtain open and have a full audience the night wow. of the show. We're taking it right to the very end. Beautiful. Job. See you soon, everybody.